Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we're going to have a look at um, the little history of Windows 8 uh, from the beginning to now so um, that we have an idea where we are and where we're heading with Windows 8. So first um, in this little timeline of Windows 8 to help everyone grasp where we are and where we're heading the beginnings of Windows 8. Um, Windows 8 was released in October of 2012, first of all. So it's uh, an, about a year and a half old, um, a little more than a year and a half old operating system now. So the first version was Windows 8. Now you had different types. You had Windows 8 um, Pro and and um, depending on what computer you bought, you also had um, kind of a Windows 8 uh, home version. So, um, so there are a few versions, but um, typically a lot of computers, most computers came either with the uh, home version or the pro version. Uh, there wasn't too, mi too much mix up here. And of course, if you had a uh, RT tablet or some kind of tablet running an ARM processor, then you had an RT, Windows RT, which is a Windows 8 modified for ARM processor, uh, but these were not very popular, and uh, actually, I don't think they're worth it. So we're in October of 2012, and uh, we go on, and about a year later, in October of 2013, we get Windows 8.1. Windows 8.1 modifies the way Windows works in many ways uh, to satisfy a little more the users because Windows 8 um, at the beginning is kind of um, has a, a bad start you can say because a lot of people aren't happy. Windows 8.1 changes a lot of things and brings back in, um, that little start button at the bottom left that actually alternates only between the modern start screen and the desktop so um, it is a start and if you right click on it will brings you that menu with all the features that most people using older versions of Windows are kind of uh, used to the file explorer control panel task manager and so on programs and features to uninstall programs and so we're now in October of 2013 then we get to March 2014 and here we get what we call Windows 8.1 Update 1 or Microsoft calls it more Windows 8.1 Update. And if you have a non-touch device, well, what it adds is that little search and power button on your start screen, which is a great idea and should have been there at the start. If you have a touch device or a tablet, you might not have these two these two buttons, I have to say. So uh, if you don't see it, doesn't mean you, have, you don't have update one. It, just that on some touch devices, they don't appear. So that's for March 2014. We are now in June of 2014 while I'm making this video. And what is coming up? Well. In August, we should have what looks like this, a Windows 8.1 update 2. And if you notice in that update, if we look at the bottom left, look at this start button and start menu. Here you'll get apparently these icons, the icons of your different uh, programs. And of course, you'll also have some tile information right here on the right side of that start menu. So we're getting, apparently, we are getting a um, regular start uh, button menu like we had in Windows 7 and other versions of Windows. So. That is the interesting part of this Windows 8.1 Update 2. Uh, a 
as for how long and how uh, what other changes it's gonna bring um, apparently the start menu is pretty much the big item in the update 2 in August um, of course a lot of people have been talking about floating apps on a desktop well that is apparently not in update 2 and would probably be more in Windows 9 coming next year. Uh, we're not really sure when, but as of now, we're kind of thinking that it's late 2015. So that's pretty much the timeline of Windows 8 and uh, where it's heading. And uh, the next big update, update 2 in August. And of course, we will have full videos of that here on our official Windows 8 channel. So if you enjoy our videos, why not subscribe? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, if you like our videos, well, you give us thumbs up. It always helps. And uh, maybe you have uh, something, an uh, a problem, or some feature of Windows 8 we haven't made a video of and you'd like to have one, uh, let us know. We'll try to put that video online. And hopefully, you will come back to the official Windows 8 channel. Thank you for watching and hope to see you soon on the official Windows 8. Bye-bye.